Hello again everyone and welcome to the video and we're going to have a little catch up with my Mesa Barbarous Colony and they're going to have some direct light on them like the last time they're going to get very panicky so we're going to have a quick look and see how they get on uh, they've grown tons by the way and there's the colony now as you can see a lot has changed the queen is having a little panic attack there in the top right, but there's a lot of, of uh, new growth, new redheads, and the colony is just going from strength to strength. As you can see, that is a lot of ants. There's the queen there, next to her entourage of red-headed ants. Oh, aren't they beautiful? Aren't they sp Spectacular. And there's the brood pile there. I love watching these work. There's some big pupae right there, you can see, right in the centre mass. Right in the centre mass there. They are big, big pupae. And they are containing big, big new workers, redheads. Yeah. I'm really pleased with my mess of Barbaris colony. She's not really panicky panicky right now, which is nice. She's giving me a good look, and of course you guys a good look. That is beautiful to see, isn't it? Absolutely wonderful. You see these orange headed ones? Well, these are new, very new. Oh. Yeah, anybody uh, wanting to get messes? This has been a boyhood fantasy of mine for for many, many years. And to actually get a queen, I've got two, so two colonies of these. And this is doing great. The other one. You might remember from my other videos, you might remember the other Mesa Queen wasn't doing as good. But I'm happy to report that her colony now is at least, I would say about 50, 50 ants. A, a real improvement over four. Mm. So yeah, I just guys wanted to give you guys a little look at what these great, great girls have been up to. Making big heads. Lots and lots of big heads and giant sized pupa. Indeed, cat, indeed. It is stupendous. I've been feeding these on dubia roaches, the occasional mealworm, and of course seeds because, you know, mess up. They're a granovorous species. Oh, they are great. They are great. And this nest is it's been super from. See there? You stick a bit of water in that in that sponge here each day. Just to keep the humidity up. It depends where they want the, the brood. Sometimes they move it there, sometimes they move it there. But look at the order that they have in the their little nest. Their little nest pile here. A seed pile there, and then over here, you follow the edge, and right in the corner is their little, their little, I want to call it their little dirt pile, but we'll call it their little tip. So, and they dump all their trash in there. That is cool. Super cool. Alright, I know a lot of you are wanting to see more video, and I promise you, one is coming. He is fine. Doesn't like this cold weather. Oh, lovely. Alright guys, anyway, that's my mess of colony. I hope you guys enjoyed. And trails out.